I want to say, if you spend all your time trying to help people, when will you ever have time to help yourself? Throughout my 20 years in this spiritual community, what I've seen is that people will use you. People will seek handouts from you. People will always try to be around you when you have something that they don't have. I want to tell you tonight, whenever you're watching this video, whether it's morning, whether it's the afternoon, what you have is what others want. Your knowledge, your intelligence, your connaissance. This is not for other people. This is what makes you who you are. And when you give it out to people, you'll exhaust your energy trying to help everyone else. You have to help yourself. If I help you, you have to help me as well. That's the exchange. Whether it's monetary, that's the exchange. There's no friends in the spiritual community. It's business, nothing personal. You may see people, they come to you, present themselves as a beacon of light. But as time goes on, you see their true nature. And this is why I encourage most people, don't be too friendly. Wherever people don't like you, it's for your safety. When you look at the amass of wealth that you obtain, the success you obtain, you have to question and ask yourself, how did you get it? You got it from working hard. You got it from being who you are. Many will judge you and many will speak evil of you because you choose to be alone. Many who desire and envy you will show their true colors. This is to be expected. Many people don't know how to be alone. There is a power in your absence. When people see you too much, it's as though you're just everyone else. But when you preserve your energy, you realize how powerful you are. You have to separate yourself from the nonsense, even if it means that you have to make sacrifices such as your family and those you love. It's very hard for us because we have years that we've probably invested. But when you're on a path to success, you have to have strict discipline. What you realize as you reach your destination is that it took a lot of discipline that most of those people that you've let go didn't have. That's why you separated yourself and you should never feel guilty about this. There's nothing wrong with conserving your energy. There's nothing wrong with being selfish. Sometimes you have to say no. Some may not like it, but ultimately it's about yourself. The first law of nature is self-preservation. If you're giving out all your energy, you will deplete your resources. If you want to be happy, you have to learn to be happy alone. 